All right, so I am making a video to show you how to use Bandicam and how to set up audio and all that. I made this for a certain person, but pretty much almost anyone can use this. So, this, when you record videos and when you're done recording, right here in this output video, I mean, output folder, you can choose what you want to use, and that's where your videos will go to, so if you want to make a folder, like, for anything, when you're done recording, that's the folder I'll be sent to, so you get to, you can pick that w by pressing this button, or anything, pretty much. Uh, I want to go to the video tab. So this is for recording. A hotkey for recording and stopping means what button you press to record to stop recording and start recording. I use the alt button because when I play Minecraft you don't need to use the alt and it's really easy button just to hit. It's right in front of you so that's why I use. Uh, here's the no cursor so if you want that on that means your cursor won't show on the screen. But my cursor obviously is showing because um, I have it off. And if you take pictures, there's a hotkey for that and everything, but I don't take pictures. And there's this, and you can register, which means you can buy a uh, you can buy bandy cam, which I don't know how much it is, but you I have the free version, so that's why there's a banner at the top of all my videos. <clears throat> So now, here's how you get your audio. You go under the video tab right here. And under the recording part on the left side, you click settings. And here's for sound. You can record sound or you cannot record sound. There's a primary sound device and a secondary. On the primary, you just pick what you want your primary sound to come out of. Now, since I'm using my headset from my PlayStation, I just picked the headset microphone, Logitech USB headset. And for my secondary, this is my computer. The sound's coming out of Win 7 sound, so that you can hear me, like, chop down wood and use whatever on Minecraft. So that you can hear that in the background, but you can also hear my voice. And then you can add a logo to your video, which you can... Um, you can put it under the Bandicam logo, or if you bought Bandicam, you won't have that Bandicam.com logo. So you can just add a logo that you like and put it on. So, yeah, that's pretty much all you have to do for Bandicam. So, thanks for watching this tutorial on how to use Bandicam, and I will catch you guys next time.